Hey everyone, um, I wanted to share this really fun project with you today. I just did a demo for Sakura using uh, Jelly Rolls and Microns on Clayboard and I had a really wonderful time. It's quite an unexpected combination. So I'm just going to play a time-lapse version of my demo and explain the steps briefly. So the first step is going to be to use a black brush micron pen, and you're going to chase that with a wet brush. So what we're doing is we're diluting the ink on that really smooth clayboard surface. This is not something that you can do on standard watercolor or typical paper like Bristol. Um, that smooth clayboard surface is allowing that water to move the ink around, and we're getting some really beautiful different types of uh, strokes and values out of it. So we're going to start with our black, and then we actually just moved to our mid and light gray just to plug in some extra tones and gestural details. You want to keep it really loose for your base layer. The next step is going to be to use one of the smaller sizes. Microns come in a variety of sizes. I believe this one is 01, and it's going to give us a really consistent small line all throughout. Uh, so we'll be able to refine our edges and add in some smaller details with this. And again, we're going to start with our black, and then we have a medium and then a really light gray to follow those. Having those small lines throughout our illustration will help unify it. The next step is going to be to add some jelly rolls. We want to add some color into our piece. So I'm using a variety of different types, including moonlight, souffle, gold and silver shadow, and I believe also some glaze as well. So jelly rolls are wonderful because they're very vibrant and they're also water soluble. So we're going to be using our wet brush again to blend out the color. The key here is to not use too much water because if you do, it will pick up the black and gray values underneath um, so you just want a slightly wet brush. And as you can see, we've really built up our color nicely. Um, our gray underpainting is what did the majority of the work for us. Some of these pens have a 3D finish to them. Uh, souffle and glaze will stand up, up, up on the clayboard a little bit. So that's what's going to give it that wet look. So you can see some of that in the wings there. Um, very. Uh, lastly, I'm using these white moonlight um, jelly rolls, and these are going to be perfect for highlights. They're really uh, opaque, so we'll be able to add those on last just to give our illustration a little bit more contrast and pop. Uh, and feel free to go back in with your micron as well at this point. Lastly, I'm using a scratch board tool just to take off that top surface of pen and reveal some extra white bright highlights underneath. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this demo and learned a thing or two.